Hey, welcome back to shit. Lots of people are talking into me here while I'm trying to sell shit. Uh, and I did do just that. I cleaned up my inventory, and uh, while I was doing that, um, he's been a dick and I filled up this. I just noticed that now. That is horrible. Get, get me out. Get me out of here. Fucking talking into my ear constantly. Shit. <laughs> no, no, get up. Oh, thank you. Get away from these assholes. Oh, you're up here. Okay, good. So, so how do we actually get to the chest of... Oh, for fuck's sake. Some men just want to watch the world burn. I don't know. God, get... Get on, go, go on, get. I'm trying to be professional here, and you're ruining. <laughs> right, um, I do know there's something of a. You know, I, don't know, I don't want to talk. Yep. And you, this way. Those sailors have been talking non-stop about an orc. Has been charmed, and I have spotted her. Ah. And I see the text here, something like uh, bringing your little orcish girlfriend here might cause some trouble. Oh, that's Moira? Is that her? Yeah. Well, a source hunter. No, it's not. About time that's the just Moira. Took us seriously. Maybe you can start with the two idiots. The, uh, the bun there in her hair looks like it looked like horns to me. I won't tell her that though. You'd probably be mad. Take my leave. Oh, there she is. Come now. Enough doom and gloom. Cast your gaze instead upon my fair fanged filly. And her ginormous knockers. Holy shit. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I see I see your point. God damn. Ooh, and those buns there are good too. Burr. God damn. Guess it's uh, him we have to talk to. I believe so. To convince my dumbbell of a friend here that orcs are predators, not pets. God damn it, it's almost Sean Connery. Enough of that. I know how dangerous an orc can be, but this one has been reformed. Anyone can see that she's completely docile. But my prejudiced friend here still wants to kill her. Oh, that's just wrong. There's a door in the way, so we can't even see people anymore. Hopefully they don't do anything interesting. Tell me more about yourselves! <laughs> Maybe before the Great Orc Raid we had time to indulge Ninius's idiotic obsessions. But now we're needed at our posts. I can hardly believe I've been wasting time protecting an orc when I should be running them through. Excuse my friend's violent outbursts. He hasn't enjoyed a woman's touch in quite some time now. It makes him a bit... edgy. Burn! A woman's touch is less of a loving caress and more of a claw shanked brutally through the throat. I'll take my chances as a bachelor, thanks. And uh, I, I understand his sentiment, but... You kind of want to risk it. Just, just to see how it is. <laughs> What's this about the charmed orc? My friend here and I were patrolling outside the city walls. When who did I see creeping along the shore but this lovely orcish lady? For a brief second, as well, as long as eternity, we locked eyes. Perhaps confused by the butterflies in her stomach, she sprang up and began running, claws bared towards Marius. Fortunately for him, I had the presence of mind to ignore my sword and instead adroitly fling my pouch of trinkets towards her. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I see, I see what, they're, what they're going for here. A vial of love potion shattered over her head. Ah. And when she turned to face me, she became instantly enamored. Well, if you drug her, <laughs> probably helps. Insert a Bill Cosby joke here. I'm sure she must have been compelled to join the Orcish army under some kind of duress. A lady with such a sweetly savage manner would never willingly join up with those vicious marauders. Again, drugged her. So you can't really tell now, can you? 
I can assure you there wasn't a hint of sweetness in those murderous eyes when she lunged at my throat. She may be confined here for now, but who's telling when she'll escape and who she'll rip to shreds? A love potion, tell me more. Ah, oh, could I've use some of those. Amateur interest in all things alchemical. When I read in an esteemed periodical from the Wizards of Youthful Gore about an amazing opportunity that could change my life, I had to act fast or lose the once in a lifetime deal. I love when they apply like real uh, modern day <laughs> things to it, like deal of a lifetime. I also love that name, Youthful Gore. I sent away for the world famous love potion, available for a limited time only, and it has worked exactly as promised. You see what a fool my friend has been, spending all his cash on snake oil and bringing a temporarily tranquilized monster into our midst to boot. What kind of monster would lie in a published advertisement? I'm sure the effects of the potion will be everlasting, as printed. Mm-hmm. Let me tell you what I think. He'd believe it was noon at midnight if he read it on a printed pamphlet. Please tell me you can reason with him, or ditch reason and use your sword to shave him from his murderous darling. Oh. Hmm. Why not Sparrow? I, I, I kind of want to. I kind of hope that we can like get her uh, on a team or something One like that. That, that. That's what One we're doing here. Uh, she got to be put down. If this love potion is as dodgy as it sounds, she could become... Uh, she could come to her vicious senses in any time. Let her live! If that potion were truly worthless, it wouldn't have been able to charm in the first place. In this docile stage, she may prove to be a source of valuable information. That is actually true. We're going with that. Let her live. If that potion were truly worthless, it wouldn't have been able to charm her in the first place. In this docile state, she may prove to be a source of valuable information. Uh, I'm actually really liking the You're right. She chose. The information she provides could well turn the tides here in Sicile. Bravo! I trust not only the potion, but my scaly sweetheart in and of herself. So knowing games like this, this probably means that we think we've done something good by sparing her and now she'll just be tortured for information instead. Oh. What should happen? You're going to regret this. We're all going to regret this. And there's another thing about RPGs, like this man clearly doesn't want this to happen, but because the player chose it, it's... <laughs> It's just a pet peeve. He could mind. easily take his sword right now yeah. and ram it through a chest and having nothing to stop him. Yeah, exactly. And and nobody's going to, to do anything to him for doing it because it's a fucking orc and he has a point. But it's it's just a pet peeve. Let's move on. Let's see his uh, point, though. And I'll handle this threat for all our shakes. She wouldn't hurt a fly. And I won't let you hurt a horn on her head. <laughs> All right, so uh, I guess we'll just have to um, let things uh, happen and uh, oh, open and see what happens. I hope we get an update on that later. <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah. Such and courteous. I'm just gonna talk to him. Source hunters, I see. I'm Sergeant Curtius, proud protector of this house of Legion goods. Tell me about yourself. Curtius is my name. A Legion is my calling. What is... what's in the room exactly? This is a storing house for Legion supplies. Perhaps the most important building in the realm, by my and others' estimation. And I, Sergeant Curtius, have been trusted to guard it. <laughs> I'll take my leave. <laughs> God, I just love how Metal Gear that shit is. Oop, oop, oop. It fails when he sees you. <laughs> mm. He's probably programmed with like a major stat in detection or something. Oh, there's one of these waypoint shrines. Okay, so I did. I didn't go and uh, touch the other shrine where I did it the first time we played the test recording. 
But it seems like we just have to be in the vicinity of them for them to activate, yeah. and that's that's pretty nice. New information added to lock. Press L to access it. Oh, oh goodness. Charmed, I'm sure. Okay, so I can't even smell this it's not air. done yet. So there's more to that mission. That's interesting. All right, so let's move on. Where do you uh, want to go next? Uh, well, I guess this is the the only way into the um, this place some more. Mm. Uh, explore up here, I suppose. Okay. No, no, we might be able to find a market to sell some junk. Oh, hello. Ah, it's teasing us with this chest. We'll probably get to that trapdoor some from another trapdoor. Further in. God, my words awesome, are man. slipping from me. Some more legionnaires with um, Princess Leia buttons that are not horns, but instead a very weird thing. I could never take that completely serious uh, with the layer buns. Crime scene, Esmeralda, the strange cave, and I guess the yeah the White Allegiant headquarters. So those are location. Oh okay, custom marker, quest marker. Well, the crime scene is right up here. So let's just do do the crime scene first. A second, I just um, try some. Ah, orange I juice. Need orange juice. Excellent. Still closed indefinitely. Squatters keep out! Mm, keep out, you say? Sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> I fucking love those. The, you can see your legs under the rock. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Looney Tunes. Oh, god damn it. Door level question mark. It's a third level question mark door. I'm guessing. Oh no, it's raining. It is. Yes. Oh no. It's over here. I guess it's raining. Hmm? Yes, it is. Hmm. <laughs> Localized a over here. Localized rain. I'm still not seeing it. A furnace. Ooh. Bucket. Another one for the collection. <laughs> Another bucket for my collection. A hammer. Did you steal that bucket? It wasn't a steal, it was white. Huh. But yes, I nicked it. Okay, so we can make some shite here. That's cool. It's pretty cool. Future recordings, I should probably make some tea instead of having bottled water. <laughs> How loud is it on your end when I... I speak? couldn't hear that you were... Speaking, ah, okay, so. that's... Oh, well then I should have sh uh, sh shut my goddamn mouth. C kept it shut. Good job. Oh, it's so professional. Oh, some arrows. And an Ooh. another scroll. Send it to you. You got uh, a lucky thing just went off. Lucky? Yes, you were. Uh, uh, so when we loot, we can get lucky. I believe so, yes. So At least I think that's what that means. Probably what the, made me find that scroll or the arrows. Maybe. Where was the. Oh, we're just walking past the crime scene now. If you want to go okay. back and do that. It's weird. Hmm. I'll have to walk around and... Mm. Yeah. I thought the entrance was here. Well, fuck me, we should just continue down your route. Probably uh, going the Chief, way wrong way now. Uh, no one's around. You wouldn't raise a fuss if I uh, borrowed one of these fish, would you? 
Don't tell me you're going to steal. Oh, indeed. I'll sooner meet a cat wizard than see that merchant repaid. Come now. I'll be good for it. I swear. Oh, they're not talking to us. Maybe. Tell me about yourself. <laughs> it's like my my go-to line. Oh, my story's tired by now. I was a happy enough, but a prosperous enough before these lean times around Sicil began. Still, that doesn't waive a man's need to eat, you know. It does. It does indeed not do that. Why are you in the habit of stealing? I never would have dreamt of resorting to petty theft during better times. But what choice have I got now? If it's steal or starve, I'll choose steal. Mm, understandable. This is going to be interesting. So what do you think? Should I snag a fish? The merchant has to eat too, you know. Leave the fish alone. Everyone needs a hand now then. Take the fish and then I'll... None but us will be the wiser. See, this is where I make up what my character is. Uh, the merchant has to eat too, you know. Leave the fish alone. The has to eat too, you know. Leave the fish alone. Your turn. Yeah, I know. Okay, good. <laughs> Are you also trying to decide what your character would say? I'm actually trying to uh, read. Yes, you know what they say about giving a man a fish. This man should learn to stand on his own two feet. Yeah. <sighs> I suppose you've got a point. Another day, another rumbling belly. A hungry man, you know. Oh, I kinda a little bit feel bad. That thief is free for now, but I wonder how long it'll be until his growling belly seduces him back onto the crooked path. What did you think of that fish, Beep? Thank you for making that would be thief see reason. I only hope your instruction lasts. The last thing the plagued people of Sicil need is a thief among them. I'll take my leave. A leader in sight. Ally has a leader, one boosted by obedient trait. Okay. <laughs> what? What's up? You wanna go? Ah, that's what I thought. Fuck out of here. That, that could have been a very dangerous misclick. What the fuck is the oh, oh there we go. Don't scuttle away before you've tried some of the ocean's finest bounty. How many crab paws would you like? Three? Eleven? <laughs> uh, people seem a little bit desperate to to sell their shit around here. So how about their fish, Vive? I listened in while you were talking to that would be <laughs> thief. Thank you for preserving my stock. It's no wonder you source hunters are known for setting the place straight. Damn Skippy. I'll take my leave. I like how I like I like how vain I am. It's like, hey, have you heard about that fish feed? I stopped him, you know. <laughs> Would be funny if I could walk up to the quest guy in, in, in like where we where we go and just be like, hey, heard about the fish feed? <laughs> just say it to everyone. Alright, so we've just been doing uh, a lot of shopping and shit. I bought a first aid skill book, uh, thinking that might be able to to make it a bit easier for us. Then that way both of us can can heal. Uh, after I level the appropriate thing, let's see skills. Expert marksman, go. Added an ability point to one of your skills. Schools is enabled to learn more powerful skills. Casting high tier. Da, 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 da. Good. So now I'll learn skill. Quite day on the market, it seems. Fantastic. So now I can heal as well. So that's pretty good. I also figured out that the bucket Fresh is a helmet, Let us see if you and it is excellent. awesome. Excellent. Absolutely awesome. Look at that. A true warrior, a true source wonder, always has his trusted bucket with him. Uh, fantastic. 
Alright, so what do you want to do now? Well, let's try and get into the, um... Well, that house that we made to get into. I can't remember where it is. Ah, uh, yeah, the crime scene. Yeah. Alright. Since that's what we're here to do. Yep. Try and find it. It's, it's to uh, our right. And I think oh, we I have suppose, to... Yeah. yeah. We have to go I around that way we yeah. were already going. So I'm guessing... Can I zoom out? Yeah, we have to just follow this, this way around there. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, that's a bit pointless. You can slightly... Oh, okay. No, I was just locking the screen. <laughs> So, that's the crime scene house. So, I will save it here. So, we can cut the video here before we begin anything new. Murder's effort. There we go. And then we will uh, proceed into the crime scene in the next video. You can fill your bucket up. Yeah. Fantastic. Awesomeness. But that is for next time.